Welcome everyone to tonight's meeting of the Assets and Infrastructure Committee, um, George Group Council. Um, I declare the meeting open at 7 p.m. Um, the Council acknowledges the traditional custodians of land on which this meeting is being held as, the, as that of the Bidigal people of the Eora Nation. Um, I have three apologies. Are they from Councillor Green, Councillor Nancy Liu, and Councillor Sam Stratocopoulos? Um, can I have a motion to accept the apologies and grant leave of absence? Yes. Move Councillor Smirdley. Second. Second, and Councillor Almir. All those in favour say aye. 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 All those against? I declared carried. Um, there were no requests to attend by uh, audio visual link. Um, and also, staff and public are reminded that this meeting is being recorded for minute taking purposes and is also being webcast live on Council's website. The recording will be made available on Council's website. The order of business is as shown in the agenda, which has been made available. Staff and public are reminded that this meeting is open. Doors to the meeting room are to be left open unless the meeting moves into a closed confidential session, according to section 14 of the Code of Meeting Practice. Council's Code of Meeting Practice prohibits the electronic recording of meetings without the express permission of Council. Uh, mobile phones must be turned to silent during the meeting. Um, now, uh, do we have any disclosures of interest? No. No? Okay. Break. Um, and there are no speakers registered for tonight's meeting. Um, now, move to the confirmation of the uh, previous August um, minutes. Can I have a motion to accept those? Moved, Councillor Smirdley. Second. Seconded by Councillor Almir. Any discussion? Okay, all those in favour say aye. 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 All those against? I declared that carry. Um, we'll move to the next item, which is ASS 025-22. Impact of declared disaster event on council infrastructure assets. Um, can I have a mover, please? Yes. Councillor Smirdley, second up. Second. Councillor Almir, is there any discussion? No discussion. All those in favour say aye. Aye. All those against? I declared it carried. We move on to the next item of business, which is ASS 026-22, Beverly Park Golf Club Steering Committee um, report. Um, there's a confidential information. Let me know if you want to discuss any of that. We'd have to go into a closed session, but if not, we can just deal with that now. Do I have a mover? I'll move that, Madam Chair. Okay, that's Councillor Konjarski. Do we have a seconder? No. It's Councillor Smirdley. Is there any discussion? No. Okay, all those in favour say aye. Aye. All those against? Declared that carried. We move on to the next item, which is ASS 027-22, um, T22-004 Jubilee Stadium playing surface. I'll move that, Madam Chair. Move that. Um, who would like to second that? Councillor Smirdley. Um, any discussion? You must be very good in class. <laughs> <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> All those in favour say aye. Oh, just, sorry, I had a question. Oh, a question? To, yes. yes. Director to, uh, through the chair to uh, Luke, I think. Mm -hmm. um, how long do you reckon that'll take and um, will it be 100% ready for um, the trainings? Or will it be 100% ready um, for, for future events? For future events. Yeah. <laughs> Through you, Madam Chair, the, uh, the process will begin in, in October and take approximately three months to actually stolonising, which is planting the, the cooch grass. That's basically once it's done, it's growing grass, but it's the best season for growing grass, obviously, mm -hmm. over, the, over the summer, and it will be in tip top condition for future events. Yes. Thank you. Any more discussion? No. Okay. All those in favour say aye. Aye. All those against? I declare it carried. Um, we'll move to the next item, which is ASS 028-22, Streets as Shared Spaces to Riverwood Reconnected Funding and Budget Approval. Madam Chair, I'd like to move that. That's Councillor Konjarski. And who would like to second that? I'll second that. Councillor Smirnley. Um, is there any um, discussion or questions that anyone would like to ask? No. Yeah. Councillor Konjaski? No, good, thank you. Okay, all those in favour say aye. Aye. All those against? I declare that carried. Now we move on to the report of the uh, Georgia River Local Traffic Committee um, advisory meeting of the 6th of September 2022. Councillor Konjaski, would you like to move that? May I please? Yes, 
And who would like to second that? Councillor Moore, would you like to second that? Oh, I'll put my hand up on that one. Thank you. Thank you. Um, is there any discussion? No. All those in favour say aye. 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 All those against? I yeah, declared it carried. Um, well, now we're going to, um, at this point, the meeting will move into a committee of a whole to allow consideration of matters in closed session in accordance with Section 10A of the Local Government Act 1993, as these items relate to ASS 053A-22, Ken Rosal Tennis Centre Management Agreement. And in accordance with provisions of Part 1 of Chapter 4 of the Local Government Act 1993, the matters dealt with in this report be considered in closed meeting at which the press and public are excluded. In accordance with section 10A2C, it is considered the matter information that would, if disclosed, confer a commercial advantage on a person with whom the council is conducting or proposes to conduct business. <coughs> Madam Chair, if I may uh, interrupt, um, I, I personally don't have any questions regarding this and I suspect if there are any other councillors that wish to ask questions, happy to move into committee of the whole, but uh, given that um, uh, we can possibly move uh, without having to go into the confidential. The recommendation. We have to move yeah, into Not the recommendation isn't. Yeah, it's not okay, yeah. that's fine. I'm happy to move into committee of the whole as per the standing orders. All right, I'll just let me. Yeah. Okay, that in accordance with section 10D, it is considered that it is um, that if the matter were discussed in an open council meeting, it would be on balance contrary to the public interest, as um, it as information that would, if disclosed, confer a commercial advantage. Anyway, you know, it's a double up. Accordingly, members of the press and public excluded from the closed session and access to the correspondence and reports relating to the items considered during the course of the closed session will be withheld. I ask that the Director of Assets and Infrastructure, there's been any written representations of objection from the public? Madam Chair, there hasn't been. Okay. Okay, the procedural motion is required to move into closed session. Can I have a mover? Yeah. Moves Councillor Almir and seconded by Councillor Smirdley. Okay, any, all those in favour say aye. Aye. No one against? I declare it carried. Um, for the members of the public and the press, live streaming will cease and resume following the confidential session of council. Once the items are addressed, the live streaming will recommence and the resolutions which occurred in closed session will be confirmed. We will then deal with any remaining items if there, if there are any. Okay. Um, Okay, uh, we need a motion to adopt the recommendation for the closed session for the Ken Rosewall Tennis Centre Management Agreement. Yeah, I'll see it first. Can I be All right, I'm happy to move it. Okay, I'll just read it out aloud. The council yes. authorises the acting general manager to approve the three year option to extend the management agreement for Ken Rosewall Tennis Centre between council and Evolution Tennis. All those in favour say aye. 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 All those against? I declare it carried and being no further business, the meeting closes at 7.09. Thank, Thank you, you, Madam Chair. Thank you.